Good sunny day from Belize. I just made it to Kikolker um, yesterday. Um, it was a really, really long journey yesterday, but I'm finally here and I'm really, really happy to be here. It's taken about like a year to get here. Yesterday was like pouring down rain the entire day. So it was like really kind of annoying. It was kind of sad that like I got here and it was like pouring rain, but today it is beautiful and it's sunny as ever. So I'm really happy. There are two, I'm traveling with two girls here, um, Jess and Sasha, um, who I met in the Zypher Lodge in Lang Quinn. We started off our morning with some yoga at Namaste Cafe. We just went and got um, some breakfast and coffee. Cheers! But we're just basically gonna explore the island today a little bit more because it's so beautiful to walk around. And then we're gonna go snorkeling in Shark Ray Alley, something I've been wanting to do for so long. I'm really excited that it's sunny so I could get to show you guys like the true island life here. I wonder when the craft market is. So we've been staying at Bella's Backpackers um, on Key Colker. We booked the snorkeling like two or three of the hostel and it was $45 or um, what would that make it, 90 Belize dollars. But we're about to set sail, I think. They're very slow here, which is fine because it's island life, but I'm like, let's go, I'm excited, I'm excited. I got the girls here. You can't wait. Woo! <laughs> we're gonna see some, <laughs> we're gonna see, we're gonna see some animals. <laughs> sunny day I don't have my hat or anything <laughs> but I want to bring you guys out here to talk about the snorkeling yesterday um, it was literally insane and like we ended up getting like almost like a private tour it was just Sasha me and Jess because nobody else from the hostel um, was going that day and this tour company only goes with Bella's backpacker hostel so it was really really nice just to have us and then Sasha wasn't feeling good so she left us um, hopped on another boat and came back. She has some food poisoning, but it was like absolutely insane. The first part we went to a really shallow reef and I saw like eagle rays, stingrays, 
lots and lots of fish, amazing coral like I've never seen before. Next we went to Shark Ray Alley, which is where all of the sharks and the rays are. And let me tell you guys, this was insane. We had no hesitation like jumping into the water, which I thought was really funny. I think we were both like just really excited. But it was just like everywhere you look, there was a shark or a stingray or fish or coral or grass or something. Like it was like, you can just like whipping your head, head back and forth, like looking at everything. And it was crazy. Like the sharks were almost as long as my body, some of them. And like the stingrays were a lot bigger than I thought. But, like. When you get really close to the stingrays and the sharks, it looks like they're like looking at you, like they know that you're there. And that was just like a very surreal moment. And then we went to where it's super, super deep. I jumped in and I was not expecting it to be that deep, but it was really cool because then the guide came with us and he like pointed out all the fish, named them, and showed us like the soft coral and the hard coral and like trumpet fish and all of like the really cool things that you wouldn't really see. But anyways, I'm leaving Key Coker today. I'm going to San Pedro, uh, switching hostels, switching up the environment a little bit. I'm excited to see another island before I leave the country. There's definitely so much more you could see um, in Belize, like Hopkins and San Ignacio I really wanted to go to, but just didn't have time. It was just overall like, the most amazing day I could have asked for and I'm so glad that I vlogged it for you guys and get to show you guys um, so you get to ins get inspired to come to Belize because it's literally heaven it is beautiful but anyways guys I'm gonna end the vlog here and pick up to compare Key Coker and San Pedro subscribe if you haven't already and like this video if it was helpful or inspiring um, and I'll see you guys in San Pedro <laughs>